Everybody, welcome back to another episode of Falcon Blaze Rim World. I'm not sure why these introductions are getting so weird, but I still attune it to me. Still not being completely healed, I'm still a little bit sick as I record these, hence why this episode, probably the two episodes prior to that, might sound a bit weird from my standpoint because of my voice, but I apologize, I'm still a little bit loopy on, um, you know, medicine as well, so... Uh, I'm not intoxicated, believe me, it's not the same first six episodes of Falcon Plays, uh, RimWorld Alpha 4, where I was drunk out of my mind, even though apparently, according to you guys, I did a pretty good job of hiding it, so hey! Um, <laughs> believe me, that's what I do in my day-to-day -day life, I'm just like walking around drunk and nobody even knows it. It's like, Falcon, are you drunk? No, man. Oh, I didn't think so, it's like... <laughs> If only you knew how much of a fucking fifth of vodka I just drank before I talk to you, my friend. Either way, research screen, uh, let's go into charge wire. Excellent. Perfect. Alrighty. So yeah, I'm a little bit on still like, you know, cough medicine just to kind of help me get over my, you know, mucus problem that we have going on over here. I mean, don't get grossed out, guys. I mean, let's be adults here. It is a bit of a mucus problem, unfortunately, but, you know, it's unfortunately, but, um, you know, I need to get over it or otherwise, you know, my voice is never going to sound the same again. So we'll put metal walls right there. Oh yeah, by the way, we had a crash lander, right? He's been renamed to Immortal Fox, so he's no longer Kramer. By the way, can somebody go and capture him? Oh, we can't because there's not enough rooms in here. So, what I will do is actually put a quick uh, sleeping spot right about here. And with that, we should be able to capture him really soon. So, uh, Tyzilla, I know you're kind of building the turrets. or trying. No, you're not building it anymore. So, Tyzilla, you go over here and uh, rescue Immortal Fox. I'm not sure why he has to capture him, you can just rescue him, I mean, he crash landed, we should be able to rescue him, you know? And let's do fast conveying. sure, we're almost done with the researching, which is good. Again, I'm not a big fan of the researching, it's uh, kind of like, you know, it's just a waste of time in reality. I understand why it's there though, but yeah, I wasn't a big fan of it, that's all I could say about that. So let's do kitchen, we're almost done. So hopefully Batman will be done by today, we get rid of the researching altogether and just, you know, wish it all away. Furnace, that should be the last one, right? Hopefully. Get it done, Batman, right now. Oh, let's see. So we failed to recruit Lakota. And there it is. No more research to be done. Excellent. So Batman, you, my friend, are going to go back to being a worker. I know you've enjoyed not working, motherfucker, but um, you have to do your part, too. So crafting, let's turn you into a 1. Um, 11. And Two-Face is also a 9. So Two-Face could go back to, you know, being a good worker. Maybe a little bit of cleaning, too. And then, uh, Batman is gonna go back to crafting, and... i make this like a two. We have a lot of good workers, it seems, this uh, colony. I do like that. Alrighty, so, good to go. How's our food? Our food's starting to drop a little bit. But, um, nothing that a few little extra hydroponics could, you know, you know, fix. Again, we haven't expanded on this in a while, I do understand that. But that's because I've been kind of focused on some other things, so hopefully you guys understand what I'm doing here. Oh, we actually got Ohm, so we got our first recruit, finally. Let's find out about Ohm. Shooting aid. That's really good. And capable of carrying his social? I don't care. <laughs> you don't care and I don't care, so that's perfect. You're, uh, you, this guy's like an anti-social type of dude. Pretty good guy. Alright, so Ohm. You're a decent grower and a good fighter. Alrighty, that, that's work out. You know why that's easy? Because now it just means that you go into growing, right? And say fuck you to hunting. Which is firefighter. We'll put you as a hauling as a two, and then everything else could kind of go F itself. So, these are the easiest setups, because, you know, he's a good fighter and a good grower. That's all I need to know. Um, so speaking of which, since you're a good fighter, we have a lot of weapons, by the way. We should probably start giving better weapons to my guys, huh? So since you're an A at fighting, how about you go and equip this M16, my friend? Go, have fun. Our metal bars being moved, here they are. And, you know, what happened to our centipedes? Oh, right, it once- Oh, there it is! <laughs> yeah! Alrighty! Centipede! Hell yeah! <laughs> the centipede named Mie. Alrighty. So, um, incapable of a lot of things, but at least it could- Oh, this one could shoot and do melee. Oh, this one can't haul. The last one that I built off camera could haul. That's weird. I wonder if it defers. Huh. Look at this guy. Loyalty, happiness. Ah, That's a cute little guy. You know, the centipedes are supposed to be, like, really vicious, but they're relatively- Oh god. Never mind. Those eyes are, like, staring into my soul. All fucking five of them. Alright, never mind. They're not that cute, but, you know, at least they're not out to kill us, which is always a good thing. So, let's find out about this guy. Do- can I give him, like, task? That would be pretty cool if you can. Uh, but, oh, you definitely can. So, firefight? Yeah, if you could firefight, that's good. You could go hunt, and you could- you can do hauling. Alrighty, good. He could clean, too. <laughs> Alrighty, go ahead and clean. Clean away. 
Um, hunting, not yet, because we don't have the, um, we don't necessarily have the actual, you know, kitchen area set up yet, so I don't know if I'm going to really waste my time with hunting for now, but it's something that I do have to get built soon enough. Alrighty, um, what the fuck did I do here? Oh yeah, this is where I stopped, so we have to actually deconstruct this now. Alrighty. And, uh, it seems like we're going to build the one outside soon, hopefully, and what do we have here? Uh, another dude! Excellent! Who is this guy? Redfields! Redfields, you're kind of like, you're a pest guard, and by the way, you're about to get trampled by all those fucking roaming buffalo. Alright, so we need another bed now. For this individual. Actually, we don't, because uh, one of the dudes got recruited, so that'll take over that spot. So, let's just send, uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. who are we looking for here? Nab. Nab, you go and rescue or capture Redfields. Alright, good, good, good. Good stuff happening here. Alrighty. And you know what? Um, we need to start actually building a few rooms, so since um, Om is actually a decent fighter, he's going to actually recruit himself, or not recruit himself, but... Need to call on his bed, that's for Om. So we're going to actually give him a bed over here, where the uh, good stuff's serving table. Oh, that's from the new mod. I'm really interested to mess with these, but again, right now I'm kind of building the bare essentials. Really. Like, you know, before you get too fancy with RimWorld, at least my, how I usually play it, is that I like to... Get everything that's really important up and running first before I start worrying about adding like fancy stuff, you know? So that's how I kind of play the game. So hopefully you guys understand that. And if you know you don't, then you know, apologies, but we all have different playing styles, obviously. So we'll do this over here, this over here, and this over here. I'm gonna start building some rooms over here as a matter of fact. Alrighty, so Levolution sleeps there. So again, we have to kind of um, re-roll our rooms. We have to find out who needs to kind of uh, move away from there once we have this area packed up. Because again, remember, this is going to be... The top rooms are going to be only for good fighters, so it makes it easier for me to know who to recruit easily on the fly. Why are you bringing this guy over here? No, that's not good. No, don't take him there. Don't! Tyzilla, capture him and take him to the fucking... No! Tyzilla, you are an imbecile. Take him to the fucking prison. Jesus Christ, this guy. <laughs> He's about to have a mental break. Oh, you're mad that I insulted you? Well, I'm sorry. There's a prison over here. Don't. Br what is... Fucking... <laughs> Centipede, get out of the prison. What are you doing? Go work. Go do something. <laughs> I'm sorry, this fucking setup is just walking around the calling like he owns the place. Go work, man. Oh, there's another one out here. This one's got a minigun. So this one's got a minigun. This guy has a charging or charge blaster. Alrighty. <laughs> so here's another question. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just laughing. This fucking centipede. Do we rename centipedes too? So, um, I'm not going to spoil this. I'm not going to put annotations uh, ahead of time like I normally do. Once this episode is out, which is, you know, right now, since you're hearing it, it hasn't, it hasn't aired yet because, you know, I record ahead of time. It, never mind. Let's not get into involved with that. You're hearing me right now. Do you guys want me to rename the mechanoids to viewers? Or if not, then we won't do it. But, you know, um, I'm not sure how to even do this. Like, I feel that some people are going to want to be mechanoid centipedes, but at the same time... Everybody's going to be jumping at them. So I'm going to continue doing it the same way. If you're next in line, if you guys want me to rename the centipedes, I will do it. And if you're next in line and you happen to be available for the centipede, you will be. I, I'm not going to assign like special privileges. Like, So please don't be like, Falcon, I want to be the centipede. I'd like to make everybody the centipede. <laughs> or like just have a colony of centipedes, that'd be kind of weird. But no, I mean, I'd like to have everybody, you know, like special privileges, but I can't do that. It's, it's hard to keep up with everybody, right? So if you guys want me to rename the centipedes, I will. And if we do it, we're going to go by the list again. So, if, you know, you guys say yes, whoever's next on the list will take over the centipede. That's all I'm going to do it. Otherwise, you know, it gets a little bit too hairy. People start getting mad and, you know, I don't want to... I want to avoid that. The drama of YouTube, essentially. So, hunting, let's turn that off for now. Let's turn you into a hauler and a cleaner as well. <laughs> this fucking centipedes, man. Alright, is he coming inside? Oh, he totally is coming inside. He's like, fuck that, Falcon. Don't build me outside. I want to be an inside centipede, too. All right, come inside, man. It's all good. Do you guys? Do these guys sleep? I don't think they sleep. All right. All right. So, um, beds are here taking up. Good, good, good. Um, alrighty. So we still need to call on his bed for Om, and he'll take over one of these guys once it gets built. I would imagine, right? Okay. 
So, failed recruit champs. Alrighty, so one of these is going to be for, oh my god, I imagine. Need call on his bed. A lot of people idle right now, that's understandable. Oh, um, alright, so that's Ohm's bed right there. Another one? Did we recruit somebody else? Uh, did I not realize this or what? Don't tell me the centipedes need beds, right? That's just silly now, game. You're getting a little bit silly now. Who needs a bed? I don't know who needs a bed. Um, passing by, yeah, I don't care about that. Mental bricks soon. Why? Nab? Nab and Tyzilla. We'll get some sleep then. Alright, you know what? We have to... Oh, you know what? We... Lights are off because of the foggy rain? No! Why is... Oh, you know why? Because I disconnected everything in here. I'm a fucking idiot. I just realized that. Alrighty, never mind. Um, apologies. I will... Ah, oh, we can't do. Because of the ground. Alright. Alright, one second here. One sec. How do I do this? I can make metal walls here. And then like a power conduit, or I guess we could just put like a regular power conduit here. I guess that would probably be easier and faster. Alrighty, there you go. There you go. Somebody build that soon and then... <laughs> I forgot all about that, man. I've been fucking up really bad. That's been going on for a while probably too, so if you guys have been yelling at me to fix it, I apologize. I'm just an idiot. For some reason I thought there was like a solar flare in half of my base, but not the other half. Cause that makes perfect sense, right Falcon? It does, man. It really does. Look at this guy! Look at Squirrel! He's over there hauling food into the hopper! <laughs> yeah! Look at these guys. centipedes. When you get off the table, people eat there, right? Speaking of people eating, I need to expand my eating zone. There's a lot of stuff I need to do, obviously, but... You know, we'll take it slowly, I suppose. <laughs> I've been saying that for a while. There we go! Power's back up! To a degree. Okay. So, I still need Khan in his bed, which is... I'm not sure what the fuck that even means. Who doesn't have a bed? Alrighty, so let's just uh unmill or let's just go ahead and alright, there you go. So whoever needs beds, take over these guys. I suppose I had them right there for you know, so we could kind of uh rotate our stuff around, but that's not gonna work out for now. Why is the game pause? Keep running. No reason for you to be stopped right now. Okay. So is everything up and running out here to a degree? I hope so. Why aren't these guys online? Is the real question, and that question really Befuddles me right now. Oh, it's because of oh, you son of a fucking bitch. Alrighty, these uh, power conduits are becoming a fucking pain in my backside really quickly. There you go. So once that's built, that'll be online, and that'll be the last thing we need to do, right? Right? Right. Now, mind you, we could build a few more centipedes. Um, I'm gonna roll with two for now, just to see kind of how it rolls. I want to see how it affects two, like. How does it affect the colony if you have more centipedes? Does it, do they send more raiders after you, etc, etc? So there's a lot of things that we have to kind of keep into consideration right now. Before we get too centipede crazy is basically what I'm trying to get at here. So... That's about to get built right there. Good, alrighty. So, everything should be powered up properly now, no big deal. Good, everything's fine, alrighty, good. So... One of the things I need to do off camera is actually rotate the rooms and find out who needs to be moved. Because again, we want to do this like by a... Uh, military standpoint, but I'll do that later. For now, what I could do... You know what I should do is actually bring a few lamps in here because it's getting a little bit fucking dark in here. Actually, you know what? No! Let's actually start increasing our battery supply here because we do have the room for it now, so we'll do like a... Uh, make this like a whole fucking battery room, right? Why not? Yeah, so we'll do like battery... battery... Wait, 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 wait. We need to be able to get around them too, right? In case of fire, so let's cancel that. And what we'll do is a large battery like so. Like so. We have to break that one down. And can we get to around this one? We can get, uh... Yeah, we should be able to. But in case we can't, let's actually do... Uh, let's get, do... <laughs> we'll do this, this, and then we'll do another one right here. And that'll work out. Alrighty. So let's get those up and running. Do I want to do power conduits in here? I, I guess I do. I don't really have to do the fancy ones for this shit, so... Power conduit like that. And we'll have another one like so. And again, that'll connect to the wall. Okay. And then soon enough, we'll basically start um, cutting this down right now. What's going on over here? No. Oh. Those batteries, as you can see, are now being drained quite badly because uh, we have a lot of stuff that drains a lot of power. Uh, we have nine deleg. Alright, my friend Dialeg got recruited. We saw that, but I missed it. So, Dialeg, let's uh, see about giving you some stats here. Actually, wait. How are you as a character? 
Shooting 10, melee 7. Holy shit, alrighty. I'm digging this. Uh, so you're a terrible worker, but a good fighter? That's all good. <laughs> that works out, believe me. That makes it a lot easier for me, too. So what I'm gonna do for you is just gonna be uh, hauling and cleaning. And then fuck that. Fuck this. And turn that off. And once we do hunting, I'll be able to use you. But for now, we don't need hunting. So evolution, you could kind of go off of hunting as well. Alrighty. And we should give you a weapon, though. So, Dialect, since you're a 10 in shooting, let's hook you up with this uh, assault rifle. That <laughs> sounds like a good idea, to be honest with you. Alrighty, so, that's done. Battery room's gonna get built soon enough. Um, let's actually light up the hallways, right? Make these guys a little bit happier. And we do that by going into decoration, no power, nope. Right, furniture. What am I thinking? It's my first day playing this game, apparently. Um, let's just go with regular white. I don't really like the colored ones too much, to be honest with you. Plus, I've had, like, a bad experience with them in the past. They've never worked, so, you know, fuck them. Um, so, that's already lit up. Let's do a light one in a corner like so. We'll do another one right about here. Actually, wait, wait. That's a bad one. It's a bad one because we could just put one into this hallway like so, alright? And do the following over here. Okay, so that works out pretty good. Right? Did I do that correctly? I absolutely did. Okay, so we have that up in the corner. This should be up in the corner too, if we want to be, you know, completely even about the whole thing, but whatever. So we actually recruited somebody else right now. Keep that in mind, and um, we need to run some more power conduits down now. So we'll do down through here, and then just run you like so for now. I might as well start doing the same over here, right? Yeah, okay. We need another colonist bed. And who got recruited? Let's find out. This, no. Just somebody just joined us without, um, you know, anything. So, oh god damn it, another roly-poly individual here. So we have Isadora Wanderkavst. Wanderkavst. Alrighty, that's all good. Growing 11. <laughs> yeah, I can see you like growing. I like eating, don't you, uh, Isadora? Uh, mining six, and not a good fighter, but alrighty. A good grower at the very least, and that's not a bad thing. So, Isadora. Firefighting, doctoring, yeah, sure, go be a doctor. <laughs> if you really want to. One on that, and mining can go F itself for now. You'll be our grower. Make you like a hauling a two, and cleaning could go turned off, and... You know, doctoring like a three. How about that? Alright, that's good. And, you know, you're a three in fighting. Might as well give you a weapon, even though, you know, just for, like, basic protection. Here, a quick, oh, what the fuck is that? M1911? You know, to me, that sounds, like, amazing, because, again, Falcon's rule of rule of thumb. If it has a lot of numbers, it must be good, but, um, you know, it looks like a handgun to me at the same time, so who knows? Who are these guys? Why do you guys have guns? Are you guys trying to intimidate me? How about you go fuck yourself with that Glock 19 before I turn my turrets on, alright? You're not intimidating me, blue-haired individual. Oh, speaking of blue hair, we haven't customized our guys, have we? Oh, dude, we should do that. Alright, I'm gonna do that next episode, though. Not this one. Next episode, we're gonna do a little bit of customization, because it's gonna take a little while to go through some of us, but... Or at least through some of the colonists, but, um... At this point, I think it's a little bit too late into the episode to actually do it. So, what I want to do for now, as well... Man, alright, these power these batteries need to start building up some power, by the way. Hopefully that happens sooner than later. Okay, so that's up and running. Uh geothermal's up and running here too. Oof. Our batteries are gone. <laughs> that's not a good thing at all. Our battery power is completely done. Oh, we got, actually got Lakota though. So Lakota. Let's find out about Lakota. Shooting six, not bad. And mining seven already. Good. So Lakota, let's have you. Be a miner, and let's like, I don't know, make you like a two over here. Turn that off, turn this off, and hauling like a two, turn this off. Let's actually turn this like a three. We'll give you a gun as well. You're not a bad shot, you're almost a seven too, so let's have you hook up with the... What the fuck is this, 11 blaster? Let's get you that uh, M1911911, whatever gun. I really want to see how that works. Alrighty. Uh, batteries are completely jacked up, though. We have absolutely, like, no battery power stored up now. Which, um, is probably because we don't have enough geothermals, I gotta imagine. See, a lot of our stuff's even powered up anymore. So, 
we're kind of in dire straits in terms of power, meaning we're going to have to actually add a few more geothermals. We could probably add them like over here and then seal this area off. I think that would probably be for the best right now. Yeah, so I think I'll do like a geothermal, or not a geothermal area. Well, we could do a geothermal, right? Because I do have the laser drills already set up, don't I? Like we go into power. Um, I, I should have it. We could do a power plant. I, that wouldn't be a bad idea, too. Wait, where's the, um, you know, the little zzz, the thing that drills into the fucking ground? Where is that at? It should be somewhere here, right? I mean, I'm not tripping balls, right? I know I added that. Game, don't mess with me right now. Production? Is it production? Oh, there it is. Laser drill. Yeah, we could, you know, we could do these laser drills and add geothermal, so we don't need, you know, we don't need, uh, those sun things anyway. <laughs> what are they called? I forgot their names. Solar generators. There you go. The sun things. We don't need the sun things, aka the solar generators. For a second there, I'm so blind, I read that as bitch soil. Alright, you know what guys, let's call it an episode here. Uh, I'm gonna actually kind of uh, go over this a little bit and kind of think where I'm gonna add some of these geothermals so we can kind of power up our batteries because that's a really bad sign right there. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, I encourage you to click thumbs up button. The support really does mean a lot. Overall though, I'm having a lot of fun with this calling and now. Things are starting to happen now. We have centipedes running around helping us out and it's fun. It's really fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you next time.